Hey everybody, this is Don over at Johnny's Used Cars. Voted the best place to buy a car in Okinawa by the military community of Okinawa for the second consecutive year. That's right, we won last year in 2023 and we did the repeat for this year in 2024. Stop by, we'll show you why like we have many, many others. Today I'm sure there's 2008 Mazda Verisa that just came in. It has almost 58,000 kilometers on it, which is only 36,000 miles. Before I get started, I'd like to let you know that we do have on a lot discounts. So the price is seen on our website right now will not be the final price when you come on a lot. Also, if you're arriving to Okinawa soon, you just arrived, please make sure you stop by Johnny's Z's Cars as soon as you can and have a look around. Even before you get your sofa driver's licenses, there are benefits of doing it that way. So with that, let's have a look around. I'll show you the features inside. But first, I'd like to ask you to please watch the video until the end. I do go over a lot of information in my videos, gonna answer a lot of your questions. Things like the JCI, the warranty, the financing. I cover all that and more, so please bear with me till the end. You have all the answers. If not, please contact me or stop on by. This Mazda Verisa is a 500, I'm sorry, five passenger vehicle in the 500 series category, so the uh, mid size category. Road tax per year is going to be 7,500 yen, which is about $50 right now with the current exchange rate. Road tax is due every April, May timeframe. So we're going to take care of the 2024 road tax for you. You won't have to worry about this till next April or May. Now, I do have two options to pay for this. First one being U.S. dollars cash outright, which could get you a larger discount. Or take advantage of 0% financing for 24 months with zero down. Yes, we don't have a down payment requirement, but if you want to put something down and reduce your overall monthly payment, you can. A lot of our customers do like 500 to 1,000. Some do half, some do more. It's up to you. Before we go inside, I was like showing you the rain guards. Rain guards will allow you to roll your windows down a little bit this way. If it rains, it's not going to get wet inside. More important feature benefit is, it's going to be that cross ventilation, get that extremely hot air out. And always get yourself a good windshield visor. You got to keep that dash as cool as possible. So in addition to that, you may consider buying a dash cover. Or if you want to keep it simple, just get a larger bath towel or a beach towel, lighter in color, and drape it across the dash. All right, with that, let's just go ahead and jump inside. Like I said, it's just coming in. It's going to be a little dirty. And I really love this uh, interior. It's pretty nice. Uh, key fob on your person, foot on a brake. It is a, uh, you just go ahead and crank it over as if the key was in there. Now, if the key fob battery dies, you can pull this out like a regular key, and this pops off, and you can insert it like a regular ignition. Let's go ahead and turn that radio off. I don't see an off button, so I'm just gonna do that. Sorry, Troy. All right, let's sneak this in here. 57,857 on the odometer. Showed you a couple of warning lights. Uh, the one, the circular one is your emergency brake. This one's a hand brake, so when you disengage it, it goes away. Engage it, comes right back on. And the one to the left of that, obviously your seatbelt one. Make sure you wear your seatbelts. They do give tickets on and off base. Other than that, it's a very simple, straightforward, straight ahead instrument cluster. And it pops up on a dash while you're driving, especially if it's red. Please flow over, find out what it is, take the necessary action. Off the left here, you have your radio. This one does have a rear camera. Air conditioning controls. Uh, cup holders, your shifter, the handbrake as I told you about, and it does have an armrest here. Continuing to the left, above the glove box, you have this space for storage and a mirror. And then the glove box itself. And a little bit of storage and cup holder on the passenger side and only storage on your driver's side. That is your passenger space over there. You got your red road flare hanging out way back there. And then this is uh, the space I have on my side. The seat is now all the way back, all the way down. I am 5'11", as everybody loves knowing. Um, I'm pretty good where I am, or I can slide this up a couple inches and still be comfortable driving. Let's go eye level. That's my eye level right there. Really can't see anything past the windshield wipers like on most vehicles. Go all the way back. Now normally I take this time to show you the auction sheet, showing you that this is a non-accident vehicle from mainland Japan. Please keep that in mind. Graded non-accident from the auctions up in mainland. Well, there's other dealers out here can't tell you that on all their cars. We can for each one. But because it just came inside, or it just came in, I uh, keep those inside the office until it's been uh, detailed. Once detailed, I'm going to put it up here on the sun visor, on the driver's side, so you can see that for yourself. We'll help you decipher if need be. And there are dealers that will try to discredit the auction sheet. Stop by, we'll explain why. Let's go over a couple of things, uh, other things before we go to the back seat. Uh, over here, you do have an aftermarket dash cam, okay? It looks like it has a drive recorder on the back glass there as well. A lot of times these do not come in with a micro SD card, so if it has it, great. If not, you're going to have to buy a micro SD card. This one hanging out right there on the side, that's your uh, ETC reader. That's your electronic toll collector. This works like easy pass in the States if you're able to get the card for it for the expressway. Above it, next to the steering wheel, you do have a power outlet. Off to the right side here, 
you have your, uh, this guy's gonna control the angle of your headlights, so maybe it's a foggy morning, you wanna see the street a little better, that's where you're gonna do it. And then underneath that, you have your hood release. Please don't forget down here, you have your gas cover release. And then on the door panel, you have your mirror, window, and door lock controls all right here. So let's uh, turn this off and let's head to the back seat. All right, I did have this reclined a little bit too much, but even with that, how it's reclined, I'm pretty much flush with the uh, back seat to my knees. Nothing as far as storage on the back of the driver's seat, but you have pocket storage on the back of the passenger seat. As always, be careful what you put in there. You don't want to rip it on each side. And a little bit of storage and cup holder on each door panel. It does not have any center console or, anything, or armrest or anything else like that. Okay. Let's go to the back here. Pretty nice space back here, okay? And you have a little storage underneath. Now, if you want to make this grab and go, you do have uh, two bars that you can pull out, and this comes up, it just goes on top, okay? And now you have grab and go. Very, very simple. And then to put it down, obviously, you're just gonna pop that up, that goes back in, pop this in, push that in, and then you just bring it back, and there. Now, if you need extra space, you can put that, Put that down this whole this whole thing will be open which is very very impressive with the amount of space that you get let's go to the front here show you the engine compartment i'm going to wrap this video up really clean headlights too all right there you have it it's a 1.5 liter engine which will be cleaned it's actually just needs a little touch up uh during the detailing process all right there you have it 2008 Mazda Verisa that just came in. 58,000 kilometers on it, which again is only 36,000 miles. Military price is down at 4,700. With additional military discount, we'll get it down to 4,500. Again, while you're, uh, while you're here, please ask the information you got about on a lot discounts and you will get a lower price on this. For now, the 4,500 will include a two year JCI, the one year bumper to bumper full warranty, the 2024 road tax, and the 10% sales tax are already included. Only thing on top, will be the American insurance requirement, whether they're going to liability or full coverage, which is totally up to you, and we can assist you with that here. Touching on these warranties real quick, yes, there are two-year warranties out here. However, they're not the best thing since sliced bread, so don't be fooled by them. Stop by, we'll explain why. But we do encourage you to shop around, go to the dealers, see what they have, check out the condition, mileage, and pricing of their vehicles. Then stop by Johnny G's Cars and show what we have, what our program's all about, and how we're going to assist you. We are definitely making a difference out here because we are different. One of the many reasons why we did win the Sergeant Stripes, Best Pacific Magazines, Best Place to Buy a Car in Okinawa Award for the second consecutive year. Again, stop by, we'll show you why. Don't forget two ways to pay for it, U.S. dollars cash outright, or take advantage of 0% financing for 24 months. Either way, we're good to go. Please like and subscribe, and as always, thank you very much for watching. Take care. Hope to see you soon.